Welcome to the Double E Show. Bad strategy, horribly simulated. What's going on, everybody? Jibba73, back with the Double E Show. It's Foundation. Welcome back to Murphyville, Greater Murphyville. Uh, in the last episode, we managed to get the warehouse and the sawmill and a couple other things built. And in this episode, what I would like to attempt to do is get the granary and the stonemason hut in place. So, right here, I have a granary. And I would like to have another one. Because this one currently is going to do herbs, meat, I don't have anything for slot four, and berries. Uh, you know what, instead of the granary, since we do have the one, I was thinking about placing a second one, but I don't need it just yet. I think what I'd like to do is do the uh, the cow farm. So if I go in here, uh, the cattle farm, right? So why don't we do the cattle farm and the stonemason's hut, right? Right, okay, so let's look at where we could place the cattle farm. Uh, first of all, let's do this. Let's go to, uh, where would we want to place it? Let's uh, show our borders. Okay, stonemason's hut is definitely going down this way. Um, let us come over here. Uh, how big is the stonemason hut? It is that big. Okay. I could easily... Easily fit it right here. Let's come around over this way. Yep. Stonemason's hut. Boom. You're going right there. Okay. So that will produce uh, blocks from stone. And it requires some cloth. Uh, let's see. Warehouse, Fisher's Hut. Um, no. Wooden keep, wooden wall, large stone wall. I've got all those things I can build. Right on. Unlock wooden keep. Got it. Unlock wooden wall. There you go. So I got wooden walls and wooden keep unlocked there. Come in here. Rustic church additional parts. Small stone wall. What do I need? Uh, I need uh, three whatever that is. Because <laughs> um, I've got I've got hmm. Alright. So if you're not in there uh, let's go, oops, let's go in here. Uh, market, wooden bridge, wooden keep, rustic church. And down here, the wagon, crates, right on. Town square, cleared out area for your markets. Okay, up front cross, one wood. Decorations, fantasy decorations, decorative bush, fence. So if I go town square... And I do, um, yeah, I don't want to do a town square down here. All right, never mind. Okay, so road sign requires one commoner. Um, wheat farm, need one commoner. Okay, so uh, rewards one free territory. Right on. Okay, let us uh, unpause so they can start working on the uh, stonemason's hut. Put that down here in the corner. Two villagers lack space for housing. Got it. We shall allow you to establish an outpost on your territory. As such, you will be able to participate in military campaigns for your liege. Do not forget that this is a privilege. Tell His Majesty that I will comply with his royal request. There are other priorities at the moment. 
Hello. Let's see if we can piss off the king. I don't really want to make him angry, but, you know, it happens. Okay, so, um, cattle farm. So let's, uh, let's come in here. Uh, no, let's come in here. Let's go extraction. And, uh, we will slate this here for extraction. Like so. Straight across. about right that looks about right to me okay so they're working on the trees over here I could certainly do uh, yep got all that slated to go I have room for housing here I do I don't know why they don't want to build there Okay, so I need uh, five cloth. If I do this, and I go, uh, nope, never mind. I would need to build another warehouse for sure. So, can I put in another warehouse? Should I put in another warehouse in this area? So get that warehouse there. All right. Let's come over here. Go warehouse and uh, come over here and I go control and I do like so. Okay, so we're going to build another warehouse. Plop that there. We have lumber. We have stone. Now, trade route. Uh, 20 lumber. Okay, so we've done that. Uh, trading resources, right? So, uh, set up your first trade route. Let's pause for a second. Raise your villager status to commoner. Set up your first trade route. Build a warehouse. Assign tools to warehouse. Allow tool purchase from the trading panel. Okay, so tools right here. Tools. Uh, buy until inventory reaches 30. Okay, and set up the first trade route, got that, uh, okay, I want to trade, uh, not logs, well, let's, uh, quick, take a peek at what they're buying, they're buying berries, they're buying polished stone, they're buying planks, and they're buying wine, okay, so let's trade planks, we will sell above anything above 25 right right um oh yeah let's go back into trade do they sell cloth they don't they sell honey they sell glass tools barrels and fish Dang it. All right. Well, it is what it is. Okay. So that's happened. Let's uh, unpause. We can get back to working. We've got uh, this here will not get finished because it. Oh wait a minute. Five of five cloth. Did I have cloth hanging out? Well, crap. Let us uh, assign Lauren. Uh, to making polished stone and we will come in here and we will trade uh, polished stone sell above twenty-five 
20. There you go. Okay, so we are doing that. And if we come in here. Uh, yep. Okay, we got stone in there. As soon as this one's done, I can put. I can move the stone and polish stone over to here. Or actually, I can put. I can do that. I can put the. The wood and the. Um, planks in here, and I can do stone and polished stone over here since they'll be closer. Two new villagers are joining. Shreech. Okay, coming in here. Uh, where's the fisher's hut? What do I need? Unlock the fisher's hut. I need... Uh, I've got two of those, and I need 20 serfs. Right now I've got 14. Okay. So, let's do a little bit more beautification. I'm gonna come over here. I'm gonna go here, here. Decorations. I would like decorative crate. There. Decorative crate. There, decorative barrel, right there, start construction, right on. Okay, so that gives me a little bit of life. Can I move that barrel? Edit. Um, I just, I would love to move that barrel. Okay, it is what it is there. Coming over this way. Go here, here. Fantasy decorations, campfire, lantern, skulls, dog, cat, large logs stack. Go there. Uh, stump with an axe. Yeah, come over this way. That's gonna go right. There. We're gonna go up. Plants, gravestones. We're gonna start construction. And done. Right on. Now, we have lots of influence. We're working on it. We're working on what we need. I need 20 serfs. Uh, the Splendor of your village is unlocked. A new tier of unlockables. Yay! Uh, is that in here? No. Is that in here? No. Is that in here? No. Okay. Let's do that. Close that. New tier of unlockables. Uh, five villagers lack space for housing. Okay. Uh, I think we are going to have to give them a little bit more room for housing. So let's come over here. And we are going to go um, from here. To there. Okay. Now it looks like they're already going to put up a house. Right on. Okay. So, let us do this. Pause. Because I need the stone. I already made seven polished stone. I need the stone to build that. Right on. Okay. So is this just a single home going in there? It is. Stinkers. Yeah, I got the two. Okay, stone mason hut. I'm going to leave that open. All right, let me see here. Oh, so what's my tier of unlockables? That's what I was looking at. Uh, so three villagers. We got uh, fence, decorative bush. No, those aren't. Uh, rustic church. And in here, sawmill, well, butchery, cattle farm. The cattle farm needs to go like so. Right? If I go... 
if I put it here. Right. And we'll plop this down in the corner. And then we can start getting uh things. Boom. Okay, two villagers lack space for housing. I get that. Uh, what's going on here? Waiting on a builder, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, let's go into the builder list. I should have a number of unemployed. If I click you, I can make you a builder. And if I click you, I can also make you a builder. And that'll give me a total of one, two... Uh, one, two, three. All right, that'll give me three builders. Right on. More jobs can get done if I have more builders. All right, let's uh, step up the pace. And let's see if we can get some stuff done. I'll get a view angle like such. Warehouse is complete. Okay, so while we do that, we're gonna come over here and we're gonna go, uh, hello, warehouse. Okay, that's a warehouse. Okay, is this not a warehouse? Is that a bug? Pause. Let's uh, do this. Save game. Uh, we'll go that. Episode 3. Save. Uh, my lord, we need to choose who we want to help. Uh, I shall assist the king. What do they want? Deliver 30 berries in 60 days. And we will get... Uh, that. Clergy. People. Alright. We'll do that. And we'll complete it right away. Right on. Okay, now... I don't have enough for the fisher shot. I don't. Okay. Um. It seems like. Oh, there, there's the warehouse right there. Dang it. Okay. Sign a worker. Slot one. Logs. Slot two. Planks. Over here. Slot one. Rocks. Slot two. Polished stone. So, rocks, rocks, stone. Stock maximum. Or, no, turn that off. Accept. Uh, stock maximum in that slot. Then over here, stock the maximum amount of logs. What else can we put in here? We could put cloth. And we could put... Uh, potions. Yeah, let's put potions in there as well. I don't know. We don't have any potions. It doesn't matter. Okay, where where's this at? I'm going to assume that's over here. Yep, there we go. There we go. Herman Reinhardt. Reinhardt and Herman. Yeah. Okay. Housing upgrade. Very nice. Raise your commoner. We have 18 serfs. We need 20 serfs in order to go up. Um, if that is built, do these need any? Yep, they need some stone there. And as soon as that stone is in the cattle farm, we will uh, reopen the polished stone. There it is. Start making polished stone again. Coming over this way. Not quite sure how the cattle farm works. It is part of a mod. Okay, 
So, back to producing what they need to produce, so that's fine. What are we doing on housing over this way? So if we go here, and we go housing, I can expand housing to here. Like so. this way are we extracting uh, I would like to be extracting let's extract there as well but I want to leave a little bit of forest between the two right yeah. okay so, two new villagers are joining your village, right on. We don't have enough housing for all of you. Boy, could he follow her any closer? I'm serious. I can see the back of your head, 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 I can see the back of your head. Of your head. That's just crazy. Alright. How far away are they? Oh, geez, they're a pretty good distance, actually. Alright. We're coming back over here. Who are you? You must be the trader. Yeah, you brought us some tools. Okay. So are we... Okay. You're the lumber camp. You're producing wood. Where's my sawmill? You're the sawmill. We are going to pause the sawmill. So we can get that enough lumber. Or enough logs, excuse me, to produce these other buildings. Because you're, you're killing me, small, you're killing me. So there's the stone, yep, right on. Okay, very good. Uh, building complete, the butchery. Nice. The butchery. Uh, the butchery for turning cattle into beef. Beef. Cattle to beef. Uh... I can have up to two shepherds right on. Put you up there for a moment because we're not uh, we're not ready to do that just yet. And uh, sawmill, yep, need to come over here. Right there you are. And you've got logs and planks are going to go in there. Right on. Okay, granary. One person working in there. Right on. And we will stock biff there as well now if i come in here and i go all right cattle farm is done so if i assign a villager um farm for raising cattle now do does it automatically produce cattle looks like he's working inside Right, and we're going to assign a villager for that. Let's uh, open this up. And that leave us. Yep, we do have unemployed. Right on. Okay. So somebody's going to make biff. Somebody's going to make cattle. Oh, look at that. They are. They're producing cattle. Right on. Okay. So let's come over here. Let's do this. Won't be that. Or, well, yeah, yes, it will be that. Okay. So uh, market. Come in here. Decorations. No. Town square. No. Two new villagers. No. Market. There we go. Okay. So a food stall. Um, we're going to go like this. We are going to do a food stall sign. Like so. We are going to start construction. Right 
on. We are just cranking away. Okay, so uh, they are densely packing this area, which is absolutely fine. You're making, you're making a lot of cattle. All right. Um, how many? We got 22 sheriffs. So if we come in here, we get 20 sheriffs. We need more of that. We're at 1.5 Splendor. So what makes Splendor? Let's come in here, and we will come down here, and we will go... Uh, no, not fence, not decorative bush. Crates, no. Let's go in here. Rustic church, market, wooden bridge, wooden keep, general, no. Okay. Um, decorative bush, right? If I come in here and I give them a decorative bush, right, say, there, and I come over here and I give them a decorative bush, say, right, wow, where's your front door? Back here, holy crap, okay, that's not a good spot. Let's say I put a decorative bush here. And I put a decorative bush uh, right there. Okay, that's several decorative bush bushes. All right, mark it. We are going to put beef in there. James is going to sell that biff. And there you go. There it's food and biff. Okay, uh, town square decorations. One gold, two stone. Decorative stone, decorative wood logs, decorative torch, decorative lantern. Can I, can I come in here? Put a nice little lantern right back here for the market stall. Right on. Okay, so, we can do the Fisher's Hut now, and the Lord Manor, and the hedge, there you go, we got it, okay, uh, let's see, deliver fish in 60 days, no, uh, keeping it all, because I haven't even built the fish hut yet, but, I can do the Lord Manor, and I can do the fish hut, now, pause, because I believe we also get a free... A territory. Well, that's free over here. This is free there. This is free there. This is free there. This has berries and stone. A lot of water, but it connects over here. This has berries. Not much else. This has stone and wood. This has uh, berries and woods. I think I'm going to do that one. And I don't have enough gold to buy that one. Right on. Okay. But I now own that. So if I do this, I now own these two. And I can come in here. Oops. Right here. So I can go extraction. Right. I can stop extracting here. Extracting here. I'm going to go residential, like so. Here and I'm going to go extraction. 
here. Okay. Now, that'll give them plenty. And then I've got berries over here and whatever else I happen to discover in the woods. Now, sawmill. Not producing planks at the moment. We are able to build the uh, church. Uh, let's see. We're able to build the Lord Manor and the Rustic Church. A wooden keep. Yep. Okay. Uh, down here. Uh, general. The Forester Camp used for reforestation. Wooden gate. Wooden gate. Used as an entrance. <coughs> Excuse me. Can I come all the way up here? I can't. I can only do a wooden gate on my own territory. Okay. Uh, warehouse, granary, Fletcher. Might need to build another granary soon, too, because now we've got berries going in there and we've got meat for sale. So accept, accept. Uh, what's that? Herbs? Um, let's do berries. Except, 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 except. Yep. Okay. So that looks like it's going to do it. Uh, yeah. That That's going to do it for this episode. I'm going to have them start making planks again. Why not? If you like what you're watching... Hit that like and subscribe button down below. Tell your family, tell your friends. If you have any suggestions as to what you'd like to see me do here in Greater Murphyville, put them in the comments below, because I will read them. And with that, I will catch you next Thursday for another episode of Foundation. Peace. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more, check out the playlist above or watch what YouTube tells you to on the right. Oh yeah, and subscribe.